A recent study reveals from 2022 to 2023, Montana's experiencing homelessness jumped by 45 percent, and that number is expected to rise. NBC Montana's investigative reporter Bowen West is taking a look at the challenges for those on the front line of the crisis. Recent data released by the Montana Continuum of Care Coalition shows Missoula's homeless population at nearly 450 people. For the homeless outreach team, they've grown accustomed to seeing new faces. It's just really tight for folks, so we do see new faces all the time, unfortunately. They expect an uptick in homelessness this summer, which is challenging for the five members of the outreach team. It'll be busier, I think. You know, we have a team of five of us, and so we're stretched pretty thin. Leahy says they've seen an increase in demographics across the board. Young adults, elderly, and refugees are all adding to the numbers. The Johnson Street Shelter opened last fall. And for the first time in its history, it's going to stay open throughout the summer. The shelter, normally used for emergency and winters, was opened up year-round thanks to ARPA money. A new source of funding will have to be found if there are any plans to keep it open after September. An official said, on average, they've had about 100 guests per night at both the Pavarillo Center and the Johnson Street Shelter. I think people benefit from the ability to attempt to choose where they want to be and, and be near those they trust. Another challenge facing Missoula is maintaining relations with those in the community after restrictions on urban camping. A lot of the relationships that we build with folks get broken down when some of these policies come through and it also makes it a lot harder for us to find people when they have to be up and out of a spot within so many hours. Reporting in Missoula, Bowen West, NBC Montana.